For the next problem, I want you to find the area of this triangle. Uh, what to do? First, I want you to apply the formula that you see on the screen. But the problem is, if you want to apply that formula, we need to find other information. We need to find the side C because we don't have it. Then what to do? First, I want you to find angle B. Find angle B. How can we find B? Simple. Subtract the two angles that we have from one, 180 degrees. Use your calculator. And the angle B is 47 degrees. Now we have a pair, angle B and side B. What to do? I want you to find side C using the law of sines. What you do? Solve for C. The terms in the diagonal multiply. And divide by the term in the denominator, the one left alone. Now substitute all the values that we have. Use your calculator. And round to one decimal place. Now, we have all the values required for the formula. Substitute er everything inside the formula than we have for area. Use your calculator. If you want, you can use the key fraction, the fraction key, numerator, denominator.
And remember, round two, one decimal place. Don't forget the square units. And that's it. We found the area of the triangle.